Hello everyone, and welcome to my Emmerdale News YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. Rose's presence has changed everything for Kim Tate, Claire King, in Emmerdale. Wills, Dean Andrews, attempt to assist Billy with childcare was thwarted this week when he quietly slipped into the hospital. He came face to face with Rose, his ex and Don's mother. In upcoming episodes, Don is distraught after meeting Rose and refuses to discuss the situation with Billy. Meanwhile, after receiving directions to home farm, Rose approaches Kim and requests to meet with her daughter. Don eventually comes home and meets Rose again. She agrees to meet, but informs her mother that Kim will be present during their conversation. After Rose puts her heart on the line, Kim discreetly offers her 2,000 pounds to go back to Spain and never return. Despite increasing the offer to another grand, Rose refuses to budge. Kim, frustrated, tells her of the other, harsher options she could choose. With no other option, Rose reluctantly accepts and goes. Rose is joined at the Woolpack by Carrie and Gail, Rachel Gill Davis. When Billy comes, he urges Rose to leave. But with an audience, Rose flips the script and confesses that Kim has paid her off, leaving Don startled. Back at home farm, Will is irritated by Kim's newest maneuver, but Don comes and shares some unexpected and upsetting information. Rose is staying with them. Kim is continuously puppeteering, and I believe Don crosses a line there and realizes she wants to be in control of her own fate. Actress Olivia Bromley explained, Kim cannot control everything, and especially monetarily. I think the way it went down was rather devious. So, I believe it led Don to have a chat with Rose in the end, and that conversation was vulnerable and they connected. It sounds like a recipe for disaster. Can Rose and Kim actually live together? When asked about welcoming Christine Trimarco to the Dales, producer Laura Shaw said, we are massively delighted to welcome Christine Trimarco to the Emmerdale family. Christine adds a wealth of experience and talent to the role of Rose, a true free spirit with an effervescent attitude on life, and she surely promises to cause a storm for some of our villagers. It sounds like a recipe for disaster. Can Rose and Kim actually live together? When asked about welcoming Christine Trimarco to the Dales, producer Laura Shaw said, we are massively delighted to welcome Christine Trimarco to the Emmerdale family. Christine adds a wealth of experience and talent to the role of Rose, a true free spirit with an effervescent attitude on life, and she surely promises to cause a storm for some of our villagers. Join Metro Soap's WhatsApp group to gain access to spoiler galleries, must-see videos, and exclusive interviews. Simply click on this link, then choose Join Chat, and you're in. Don't forget to switch on notifications so you know when we posted the most recent spoilers. Regarding Rose's arrival, actor Dean Andrews told Metro.co.uk, We're a nice little bunch, Claire, Olivia, and Jay. But of course, it's good when someone else comes in to add drama or other dynamics, as well as to energize someone else on set. We've been on set with our small gang for three or four years now, so we know each other, love each other, and have a great time. It's fantastic. But Christine, I first worked with her 21 years ago, and she hasn't changed much. It was named Faith. The film is about the Yorkshire miner strike. He went on, and I've observed her career along the way, so I know she's a cracking actor, and I knew she fit in because she's dead down to earth, as we all are. And she's simply good. So we were looking forward to her entering and infiltrating the small gang, giving further layers to the plot. Kelvin Fletcher is beaming with pride after his seven-year-old daughter Marnie made her acting debut in a serial. The actor, 40, is most known for his role as Andy Subden on Emmerdale, which he held from 1996 until he opted to leave in 2016. Kelvin's daughter Marnie is now following in her famous soap dad's footsteps as he posted a video of Marnie portraying Lexi Roscoe in Hollyoaks on Instagram on Wednesday night. He posted a clip of Marnie's scene, 
followed by a photo of his smiling daughter behind a clapperboard, and wrote, Marnie made her TV acting debut last week as she joined the fantastic cast of a Hollyoaks official, I was her chaperone, and I can't begin to tell you the emotions I felt standing there watching. To be standing behind the camera, seeing my seven-year-old daughter act for the first time in front of the camera, brought back so many memories of when I first started acting, and it seemed odd to be witnessing it all again. But this time as a father, my heart was full with pride, and it was one of the few times I felt entirely satisfied. Seeing your child discover their passion and pursue it is one of the most wonderful and motivating things to witness. What a fantastic time for both myself and her. Well done, sweetheart. P.S. I did not receive two castings within the same week she did. Typical. Kelvin's wife, Liz, also took to Instagram to share a batch of photos, adding, Introducing Lexi Roscoe. We couldn't be more proud of Marnie for joining the Hollyoaks cast, and her first scene aired last week. Day one, she strolled on set as a sheep in doing it for 20 years, complete with heart emoticons. Kelvin's fans, famous friends, and past co-stars were quick to convey their happiness. Danny Miller, who plays Aaron Dingle in Everdale, wrote, Always was gonna be a great lad. While Ryan Thomas, who played Ryan in Coronation Street, added a heart emoji. Emma Barton, who plays Emma in EastEnders, said, Oh, I'd love this. Bless her, with a plotty emoji. Since leaving Emmerdale in 2016, Kelvin has won Strictly Come Dancing in 2019. He also has his own television shows, Kelvin's Big Farming Adventure and Fletcher's Family Farm. Ruby Fox Milligan, Caleb Milligan's fiery estranged wife, arrived in the village earlier this year and wasted no time in making enemies especially after learning about Caleb's affair with Tracy Metcalf, which she reveled in revealing to the stunned Dingles earlier this year. In subsequent moments, Ruby will become engaged in a fresh conflict, with her actions affecting several villagers in a devastating plot. According to next week's spoilers, Ruby is outraged after her sister-in-law, Moira Dingle, unintentionally splashes her while driving. Later, on a single-track road, the two come face to face and refuse to back down, resulting in a tense standoff. However, their activities have an effect on other people, as will Taylor and Kim Tate become caught in the crossfire during a devastating tale for their family. Prior to becoming embroiled in the dispute, Will's daughter Dawn Fletcher and her husband Billy Fletcher are horrified when their baby son, Evan, is rushed to the hospital after a bruise is discovered on the child's leg. At the hospital, a pediatrician reveals that he is a very unwell baby, and Billy later tells Will that Evan could have an infection, an autoimmune condition, or perhaps leukemia. Obviously, Will and Kim run to the hospital after hearing the news, but they get stuck in the lane owing to Ruby and Moira's feud. Caleb later requests Ruby apologies to everyone involved in the road feud. However, it is evident that the animosity is not finished when Ruby spreads a cruel lie about Mora. What is the rumor, and how will Mora respond? Beth Cordingly, who formerly starred in The Bill, joined the Emmerdale cast earlier this year as Ruby, making her debut on screen in January. At the time of joining the soap, actress Beth stated, I'm delighted to be joining the Emmerdale cast. It's an enormous privilege, and Ruby is a dream role. She's a firecracker and a troublemaker, and I think people will love her or loathe her. I can't wait to get digging in with this fantastic cast. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.